Hi, kumain na ba kayo? I'm Jessalyn. Let's dive into what's new in DevTools in Chrome 94. Great news! You can now use DevTools in your preferred language. Open settings. Select your preferred language in the drop-down. Chrome DevTools now supports more than 80 languages. Reload DevTools and there you are. You can help us improve the translation. If you find any incorrect translation, please report via google.girl slash devtools translate. Next, you can now simulate the dimensions of Nest Hub and Nest Hub Max in the device mode. Toggle the device mode, select Nest Hub under the device list. To view the device frame, select Show Device Frame under the More Options menu. Next, you can now get information about a site's origin trials in the Frame Details view. Origin trials are a way for you to test a new or experimental web platform feature and give feedback to the web standards community before it is made available to all users. Go to this link to learn how to register for an origin trial. Open a page with origin trials. In the application panel, select the top frame. Scroll to the origin trials section. Expand an origin trial to view the token status, expiry time, and more. Next, another new debugging feature for the CSS container queries. A new container bash is now added next to the container elements. Not sure what are the CSS container queries? Check out my last video to get a quick overview on it. In this example, I have an article element with CSS class white box. There is a paragraph in it. In the CSS, we define some alias container rules to show or hide the paragraph depending on the container size. The article element is the container here. Therefore, a container bash is displayed next to it. Click on the bash to toggle the display of an overlay of the chosen container and all its querying descendants. Next, use the new invert checkbox to invert the filters in the network panel. For example, you can type status code 404 to view the network request with status 404. Enable the invert checkbox to view all the network requests which are not with status 404. Here is a bonus tip. Use the ruler while inspecting your element. Open Settings. Under the Elements section, enable the Show Rulers checkbox. Close the settings and inspect an element now. The rulers and the extended lines help you better measure the width and height of an element. All right, there are more new features in Chrome DevTools 94. As usual, go to the video description for the link to my blog post and other information. Thanks for watching. See you in four weeks for Chrome 95. Ciao!